also posting times are gonna be on Monday and Friday so you can start your week off pretty good I guess and then end it with a good note and then sometimes on Wednesday depends how busy I am okay on with the video hello YouTube and hello daily live my name is Silas and I'm going to show you how to customize your own cup. So this is going to be mine and I'm making an outer space design and it, it's going to be pretty cool. I just see so when it's all done. So what you're going to need, we got these actually from the uh, Walmart, 50 cents a cup. Okay. So what you're going to need is a cup. You're going to need um, some brushes to, if you want to paint the background, which I did to make it out of space. Thing. So you're going to need a palette, two brushes, and this one I used to do some of the, the um, silver in the spaceship because it was um, kind of acidy. Like. And how I got the color here is um, I used... They are paint pens, and they're pretty cool. So, those are the things you're gonna need. Paint pens or paint. I'm using black. I have to paint over some of these spots because it came off and went up. Oh, and also, this is in here's polyurethane. It's to keep everything um, tight, and so it won't rub off. Okay, and now we're going to get into it. I am going to turn this over to my phone so we can get it a nice view like that. So, see you when this is like that. From this into this. And also add this to, uh, it's not circling in the back so you can see it. So, yeah. Okay, I'm back and this is all dry. Now we can get to this. So what my intentions were, right here you can kind of, you can see kind of this line here. That's gonna be Earth, and I'm gonna have the spaceship taking off, and then I'm gonna have the International Space Station right here, and then um there are gonna be planets here. So I have um I have these, so there's the space station, or not space station, spaceship, planets that I'm gonna draw, and then the International Space Station, or the ISS, International Space Station. Yeah, <laughs> okay. And these, so first, I, this will be second, then sketching this on will be first. But to get that onto the cup, I'm going to need this. This is graphite paper or more known uh, transfer paper. You can get this at Michael's. This was $3. And I used the coupons so that brought it. I got two of them and it brought it down to $6. So, yes. And also, these um, come in two packs. So, I also definitely needed some, so that's why I got it so expensive. So this side is the shinier side, and this side, that's the side that's gonna be up, and it's gonna be like this. So that's, oh. so this side's gonna be like that. You're gonna have whatever you wanna draw, and it's gonna be like that, so it picks it up. Then it's gonna transfer on to my cup, this way so yes first i want to cut some of it scissors work great or an exacto i won't be using this but you can use it if needed so what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna cut Okay. 
You only need to cut it the size for your image. And I got these images all, I just traced them off of um, the computer and I went into Google Docs, copied it, and then I put it into um, the Google Doc. So like four, well actually I'm mean, gonna probably need to do the same thing with this one to use just as big as one, like this. We're gonna have it go to this right here. And then you're just gonna wanna take your pencil and trace it. I'm going to do just uh, cut it and then I'll come back. Okay, it's really hard for you guys to see it, but I can see it just fine. So we'll get into tracing it with um, the white. One is white and silver. Is, that's basically what it is. So these just shake up and then you can draw with them. And also the paint is still kind of wet, so. Uh -uh. Just damp. Okay, and sometimes you just have to add your own spin and make mistake like I did but make it look decent so I just kind of added my own spin to it and then what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna take um, some silver and fill in this part right there and then that's where I use my my fine point brush or my fine er point brush I'm kind of just honestly going to paint it on, use um, my marker and paint some of these. And now it is kind of silvery. It's not focusing. Oh, there we go. Focus. Okay. Anywho. It's filled in, trust me. And then you can um, fill those in too. And that's filled in, it actually looks pretty nice. So now, we're gonna add those planets on. And try not to shift your transfer paper, because that's what I did, I had to kind of wing it. So, yes. This is it, and then this is gonna be done. So we're gonna have the spaceship traveling to our planets right here and then you can have it this way too why am i flipping the cup you can either have it like this or like this or do anything you want really and then remember this is just my cup and then it's just a little tutorial to get you going if you want to actually customize your own cup
Okay, this is honestly just about the size I need for this. And I think, oh, it's a bit small. No, it's really not. Because all I need is for it to cover like that. And that just about does it all. So, it's not small at all. And you can just break it off like that. It's not that clean, but it will be fine. Oh, I have it the wrong way. Just like that, they're all filled in. Now I can see all the plants. And it's super hard to see black on black on camera. So, yeah. And then I'm actually gonna make this unique and make it my own. And I'm gonna use pink and purple. Boom. Okay, and that's fine. I'm just gonna color it in. And then I'm gonna make the rings purple. Okay, and now I'm gonna, I, that will be easy to fix, but now I'm gonna make the other planets brown. And then you can just add your own if you want to as well. Now I'm just gonna let this all dry and see in a few. Okay, so now guys, we got this all painted. It actually looks not that bad. So now we're gonna use some polyurethane to make it all sealed. And now once I, when I go to go when I go to go wash it, it will um stay. <coughs> Sorry about that. It will stay sealed. So, yes. I like to use this big, bigger brush because it's just easier to uh, apply. I can speak for a second. Some of this. Let's position this up. And to note, everything is dry on my cup. So you never want to paint over it wet or if it was like just immediately like done drying. So what you do, I like to paint over this, everything like that. All right, so what you do, you I like to do it over the, my drawings first, and then I'll um, usually work around the cup, the whole cup. And just like that. Um, you can do the bottom, which I will, and then, all pro oh, I'm gonna put the date most likely. So all just like that. This is all sealed coated. It will take a few minutes to dry, but I'm going to end the video right here, guys. Make sure to like, subscribe, and I'm gonna get the comments on. I found out how to do that. So like, subscribe, comment. It only stay on for a little period of time, but make sure to get in there right when this video is released. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like, subscribe, like I said. And um, this video took a long time to make. It was a lot of drawing process. And um, yes, I hope you guys liked. Um, me, signing out.
until next time.